time with Rachel and Cash. And we're so excited today because we have finally got the last two guys to complete our full series one Gujitsu collection. So we're gonna show the last two guys to you. So we have here, Cash, would you like to show yours first? Mantor and Brawler. So Mantor and Brawler. Brawler. No. No. And we've got Mantor here. Trying to find these was like trying to find a needle in a haystack, wasn't it, Cash? Yeah. But we found them, and we're bringing them here to you guys today. So we're gonna tell you a bit about them. Do you want to start with Brawler? Got him. Is he like super gooey? No. No. He's oh. super spongy. Oh. Is that what he has inside him? He has sponges inside him. Yeah, and liquid. And liquid. So liquid and sponges. So he's like super squidgy and squishy and spongy and obviously super stretchy because all the Gujitsus are um, super, super stretchy. They all stretch three I'm times gooey. their actual size and gooey. Brawler is actually really, really cool. He's probably one of like the heavy set guys in the group. In fact, I think he's one of the strongest guys um, in Gujitsu. Um, the Blazagon is the leader of the good guys and this is the referee of the when they all play games and stuff. Oh right, so he kind of keeps everybody in line. I'm gonna read you guys out Brawler because he's like super, super, super cool. So from the frozen forest of Siberia, Brawler gets the respect he deserves by using nothing but his brawn and bare knuckles. He has the drive to be the best at everything he does. There are very few fighters who are stronger. Watch out, this guy's a hugger. So he is like super, super strong. Then he gives people bear hugs and he crushes them to death. That's not good, is it? Well, it's actually a pretty cool superhero power, but you wouldn't want to use it anybody on anybody nice. Just bad guys. You better open this guy up, by the way. Open him up, because I want to um, see what he's like. And while you're opening him up, shall I tell everybody about Mantor? Yeah. So Mantor is like super, super sandy. And he's kind of, I thought he was an alien when I first saw him, but actually on closer look, and when I refer to this little picture here, you can tell he's like a jujitsu master or something. So I'm just going to read about him here. Although he's not as big as the others, Mantor's influence and advice stretches far. This cool and calm Gujitsu master shares his wisdom with his brothers because he knows that knowledge is the true power. His guidance is treasured by all. So he's a little bit like, I don't know, like Yoda from Star Wars or like Mr. Miyogi from, from uh, Karate Kid. You know, like he's just pure wisdom. So he's the one that keeps the calm and everything. And like you said, he's the referee amongst everybody. So he must be the person that like keeps it all cool. So let's pop these guys open. Is he cool? It's so weird in his hands. Why? He has three hands. Three fingers. He has like kind of a claw. You know, he's going like this, he's going ah. He's going like. Gojitsu. He's going like, Hiya. He's going like, that's, you know, like Spider Man does. Whoosh, or what does Spider Man do? That, that's how you just talked like him. Did I? Gojitsu. Yeah. Ah, you are wise like Yoda. Oh, look at this guy. He's weird. Oh, oh this is so bizarre. Oh, look at this guy. He's got like sand inside of him. He's really, really sandy. Oh, actually, his goo power is sound force. Did you know that? <gasps> Look, I can stretch this guy really far. Hey, I'm the calm guy. I'm trying to calm it down. I don't like big crazy bears. Hey, big crazy bear, what are you doing to me? I'm the calm guy. Hey, that looks Let like me see. Blood. Let's see if we can see. It actually looks like blood and guts and. Like, this would be like, I don't know, an interesting project in a science class to dissect or something, but it's kind of gross and gooey and... Yeah, oh, wait, wait, I'll blow it up and you can see. Blood and guts! Blood and guts! I would laugh right now if that exploded in your face. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> no, I can No, I'm gonna do that. Yes, I'll fight. But I am Mr. Zen. I am the calm one amongst- I'm hugging you. Ah! Yeah, my sand is getting squished. My sand is evaporating. What are you doing to me? I'm supposed to be sandy and zenny and calm. 
but I'm not calm when a giant bear is hugging me. Ah! Yeah! I think he looks like a zombie alien. He looks like a zombie alien, but actually, he's he's totally in Zen mode. Look, he's like sitting cross-legged, and he's just like Zen. He's like, oh, he's doing his arms. Oh. No, he's not. <laughs> So we have Brawler. He is super, super, super cool. He gives you bear hugs. He crushes your bones. Even though he's made of sponge. That's so weird. But he must like I'm squeeze you so tight that his sponge just crushes around your nipple bones. And then of course we have Mr. Sandy Pants over here. Sandy Pants? Mr. Sandy Pants. You're Sandy Pants. Sandy Pants. His name, his name is Mantor and he is the he has calm, red sword. collected. Yay. Superior above all Gujitsu heroes. In our next video, we're going to show you all of our Gujitsu, all 13 that we have finally collected with all Cash's pocket money. And we're also going to give you a few wee tips um, on how to look after your Gujitsu. Okay? Yay! Ah! I think you just bent the camera. I think you just broke the camera. <laughs>